So, yesterday, I came dangerously close to purchasing some chemical fertilizer because I've got some sort of deficiency in the soil. Um, plants are kind of yellowing, so maybe not enough nitrogen. Anyway. There is nothing wrong with your television set. Do not attempt to adjust the picture. We are controlling transmission. If we wish to make it louder, we will bring up the volume. If we wish to make it softer, we will tune it to a whisper. Gonna hit you all up with that uh, warm tea tomorrow. Man, so can you really drink and do videos on YouTube? What I did in lieu of chemical fertilizers is I, I got some... Uh, because my worm bin didn't really turn out the way I wanted it to last year. They all died from heat stroke, I think. But what I did is I got some worm castings and I'm making worm tea. And it's pretty simple to make. You know, it's effortless, really. What I've done is added about, oh, six inches of worm castings. Um, you can get them uh, online, but, you know, I just went to my local... Um, I don't know what you could feed store and they had a big a very large bag of it for $22 so I've got an aerator pump a little air pump and it's been aerating it's been in here 24 hours as you can see there's the there's the aerator I'll get that cleaned off here later and I'm going to run it through I used to do gold mining and so this is this is a uh, classifier pan and it fits perfectly in the bucket. So, and I, I did notice that Larry Hall did this very same thing the other day on a video. I don't know if it was the other day, but I saw it. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go ahead and pour this in and get my worm tea ready. I'll pour the rest of it on there later. I want to try and keep this as clean as possible, but I'll because I think some of it's going to get through. But this is pretty clean. Got more than half a bucket, so about three gallons. And now to go put it in the uh, system. Okay, I'm utilizing my uh, solar panel electricity here. I've got it running through an inverter as you may or may not know by the way here's that bag a big bag of it um no wait 15 pounds for 23 bucks anyhow uh i got 110 power running out here so i've just run an extension cord i kind of hate doing that but um it's a trip hazard but for now that's what i'm doing i put a, a recirculating pump a little aquarium pump in here and it's going to pump from that side um, I utilized some drip irrigation pipe to put a little stub out into the center and the rest of it goes over to this side and it's going to circulate all this goodness. So now I'm going to remove water from the system and that way I can gauge how much I'm taking out and how much I have to put back in. So when I get about three gallons of water in there in the bucket I will uh, I'll pour the three gallons into the tubes and then I won't have anything wasted so we'll get back to you here in a second so I've dumped uh, about an appropriate amount of water out and I'm getting ready to put in the worm tea on the pump tube this is the tube with the pump in it and it's going to distribute it amongst the three tubes I hope I'll monitor it and I'll check down at the end and see if the water has changed color in a few hours. Because this will probably take a while. Careful not to spill it here. It's valuable stuff. Wow, this is going to take a while to put in here. Take, it takes a long time for this stuff to distribute out. I can end up overfilling this tube. I'll 
I bet the plants in this tube are going to be happy. I don't know, it might take days to recirculate this much water. Ooh, I'm starting to see color in the middle tube now. I think I'll save a little bit of this to put on some plants. Get this thing kind of dialed in here. There we go. See how long it takes to work its way around. Let me turn my water back on. My supply water. And that does that. Now all I have to do is edit and post this video. Let me show you what I got going on down here. Get my little octopus holder off the fence. There we go. So we have color. I don't know how far up it goes. Probably not very far actually. Yet, it'll take a while. I think I'm gonna start putting, I don't know what the heck, Thai basil. Anyway, I know that she's got some plants. She'll be home soon. And um, I'll let her put this on some troubled plants if she has any so signing off for now thanks a lot it's a short video um gee i will title it appropriately so nobody wastes bandwidth on my um garden tours <laughs> and appreciate the comments really i do um only helps to make the videos better so thank you very much please subscribe like share all that good stuff see you on the next one bye